In this video, I'm going to show you how to take your design that you imported from Inkscape and be able to cut out your part on our laser cutter. So the first thing that we want to do is we want to secure your uh, plywood square and we're going to put it in the top left hand corner of our laser. Uh, to be able to uh, turn this on, what we're going to do is we look on our lower right hand panel right there and we press our on button. You'll hear some fans coming on. Once our laser is on and connected, what we want to do is we want to bring our laser head over here so that we can zero it out. So to be able to do that on our computer is we are going to select the focus view, which is the second button in. We select that and I'm going to bring, click over my, my design there and I'll bring my head over. So now once our head, our laser head, or our lens is over the piece of plywood, we have our zero, uh, our Z zero tool, which is usually stored right here. So we pull that out and if we look really close on there, we see that there's a little bit of an angled notch on there. And that little angled notch is going to rest underneath that lip right there. And when we position this, we wanna make sure that we aren't putting this underneath that screw there because if we uh, bottom that out, we can damage that screw and our Z zeroing tool. So I'm gonna hold that in there and back on our panel next to our, our power button, we have our Z up and our Z down. And what we wanna do is we wanna bring our bed up until that notch is right at the bottom of this and our Z zeroing tool uh, kicks out. So if I go up a little bit further, it pulled away right there. There's a tiny little gap. We're gonna wanna bring it down so that it rests flat in there. When we're done zeroing with our Z zeroing tool, we're gonna bring it out back, and put it back down there. Now on our machine, uh, we have an air compressor underneath. Um, that we need to use to be able to turn on our air assist. What that'll do is that'll blow air through the nozzle and uh, make sure that it blows out any fire and also uh, cleans up the cut. The second thing that we need to turn on is our BOFO, which is uh, an air extractor that will pull out any fumes. Um, when I turn those on, it's gonna get really loud in here. Uh, so we'll turn those two things on. And then the last thing on the computer is we need to press the start button. So here we go. Turn that on. Come over. done we want to turn off our air compressor turn off the fume extractor we can open up the lid 
We're going to turn off our laser. We can press and hold the power button. That'll turn it off. And when we come and we grab our part, we have our snowflake. We want to make sure that we clean up all the parts that we have left over. Make sure that we clean up after ourselves. And when we're done with that, close our lid gently. And that is how you set up and use your laser.